What's going on everyone? Ash here with a brief update on the upcoming Nintendo Switch version of Mortal Kombat 11. In a recent interview published by Game Informer as part of their month-long cover story on Mortal Kombat 11, Mortal Kombat series co-creator Ed Boon was asked if the Nintendo Switch version of Mortal Kombat 11 would run at 30 frames per second, likely referencing the Switch's lesser hardware specifications compared to the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Fortunately, in an answer that is sure to make Nintendo fans quite happy, Boon categorically answered that such would not be the case, and that the Switch version of Mortal Kombat 11 would run at 60 frames per second, achieving parity with other platforms. Forms. And from personal experience, I can say that Boone's answer lines up with what Derek and I recently witnessed in person at PAX East 2019. Though we were not allowed to record any footage of it, the Switch build of Mortal Kombat 11 that we played at the show was indeed targeting 60 frames per second in handheld mode, and from what we could tell, it was largely achieving that goal. We won't know for sure until the game is actually out, of course, but between our own hands-on time with the Switch version and Boone's confident answer that the Switch version will run at 60 frames per second, things are looking good for players who want to experience the latest Mortal Kombat title on Nintendo's portable console. Other information covered in Game Informer's interview includes the fact that Mortal Kombat 11 will launch with a 25-character roster, with post-launch DLC to bump that number up somewhere into the 30s. Easy Fatalities will also be returning, and it seems Liu Kang will be positioned as the main character of Mortal Kombat 11's story. Although Boon notes this has pretty much been the case since the very first Mortal Kombat game, so the focus on Liu Kang may not exactly come as a surprise. We've left a link in the video description below for those of you who would like to check out the rest of Game Informer's interview with Ed Boon, which encompasses a whopping 166 rapid-fire questions, though some, as you might expect, are light-hearted and fall on the goofy side of things. And that brings us to the end of this update. As always, thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, follow us on social media, and check out our exclusive Patreon offerings using the links in the video description below. Otherwise, keep it on Game Explained for more on Mortal Kombat 11, the Nintendo Switch, and all things gaming.